Dear friends, today I will show you a very interesting AI vision module. Using this DF robot gravity husky lens, we can utilize the power of AI in our Arduino projects. It can detect faces, objects, gestures, colors, lines and we can make a lot of robotic projects and security related projects using it. The speciality is that we don't need any internet access or Wi-Fi connection for this. It has a built-in algorithm and it is very easy to use. As well as we can use it with BBC Microbit, Raspberry Pi and many other microcontroller boards. I will show you how you can use it and tell you its features in detail. Let's quickly unboxing it. This Husky Lens was sent to me from DF Robot. Thanks to DF Robot for sending me. The product link is in the video description, you can check it. Inside the box, some screw and nuts, mounting brackets, 4 pin cable for connecting to the Arduino. and the husky lens main board now take a closer look at the sensor module its quality is very nice here are two buttons it is for learning and it is for selection and functions it has a 2 megapixel camera, micro USB port, micro SD card slot, two LEDs for work in dark conditions, and RGB LED. Can write K210 processor, which is specially designed for AI and machine learning. Four pin connector for serial communication or I2C communication to MCU board. It has 2 inches IPS display with 320 by 240 resolution. The frame rate is also good. They separately send a silicon cover for it. You can buy it with or without this protective case. I think it looks better now. How does it work with a microcontroller? At first, it learns any face or objects and memorizes every object with a different ID. After that, it recognizes the memorized face or object. It sends the particular ID data to Arduino. We can drive motors or relays or any other output modules by simple coding in Arduino. So no need to upload any code to the Husky Lens. It works individually, it has a built-in memory and SD card storage option. Now I am talking about its functions. I have connected it to a power bank with a micro USB cable. The first function is face detection. You can see a square box when it detects a face. I have to place the yellow plus sign on the face. I am pressing the learning button once to learn this face. Now it is showing the face ID. Now it can recognize this face every time and show the face ID. You can use multiple faces at a time by changing setting to multiple faces. Targeting face and pressing the learning button. It is showing different IDs for different faces. The human face is three dimensional, so to better learn the face, I can press and hold the learning button and it will learn this face from different angles. Also, we can use different pictures of a person for better accuracy. 
for object tracking feature i am keeping my object inside the box and long pressing the learning button i have to show the object from different angles and distance now it can detect objects when the object enter the frame it shows the object id in the same way we can use it for our hand gesture recognition it can recognize 20 built in objects like car bottle chair person etc but i don't think it will be very useful for me and this function needs more improvement firmware version update is also possible with this husky lens it can track lines so we can make a line follower robot easily using it even it is detecting thin lines and multicolor lines color detection it can detect color you can change detection parameters and color detection threshold for accurate similar colors it can detect multiple colors at a time here detecting four different colors balloons with different ids you can see it detecting almost the same object with the different colors and showing different color ids the next feature is tag detection it can detect some qr codes this type of tag is called april tag you can download supported tags this is a useful feature for our project object classification it can classify similar object for example here are two pictures of the same employee one is wearing a helmet and other is without a helmet after learning both it can recognize the difference between two pictures and showing different ids you can set up its protocol leds screen brightness etc in general setting how to use with arduino i have connected with arduino uno the connection is very simple i am using uart protocol here is the connection diagram on husky lens general setting i have chosen communication protocol at a baud rate at 9600 i have downloaded the husky lens library after unzipping it i am copying this and pasting it to my pc arduino library folder after adding the library i am testing it using a sample getting started code uploading to the arduino uno now husky lens is running power from arduino no need extra power here you can see a face detected and it shows the face id is id 1 now i am on the serial monitor here actually appearing what is happening on the lcd of husky lens when it detects the learned face we can see the id 1 in the serial monitor now we can use this data in our projects It was a getting started guide about the Husky lens and to introduce its functions. I will make different AI projects using it in the future. Keep watching. Goodbye.